segment of the show for today. We're talking to Dr. Leonard Madu, and the topic is Cuba. And Dr. Madu has given us some information relative to uh, how the United States became involved uh, with Cuba. And of course, Dr. Madu, let's see if we can pick up at that mm -hmm. point and, 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 and uh, further uh, develop uh, our discussion on Cuba. Yes, you know, because of the policies, you know, chosen by the Castro government, which was an attempt at our own government, mm -hmm. you know, the Eisenhower administration, and subsequently, you know, the Kennedy administration, you know, started plotting to overthrow the, the Castro regime. Mm -hmm. This, you know, led to the infamous or famous Bay of Pigs invasion, mm -hmm. which in Spanish they call Bahia de Conchinos, mm -hmm. you know, Bay of Pigs. Mm -hmm. The invasion failed, of course, and after this, the Soviet Union has then came in. Uh, Khrushchev was leader of the Soviet Union at that time. They came in to support Cuba. So they put in missiles, you know, mm -hmm. all around the, 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 the island. This was a threat, of course, you know, to our government here. Mm -hmm. uh, Kennedy, you know, up the ante and said that the Russians should remove all the missiles. Otherwise, the U.S., you know, would not hesitate to attack, you know, Cuba. Mm -hmm. But after some negotiations, you know, Khrushchev, you know, had a quid pro quo. Mm -hmm. They will remove the missiles from Cuba mm -hmm. as far as we removed our missiles from Turkey. Mm -hmm. You know, this was agreed and this calmed down the situation. Mm -hmm. And because of the embargo, you know, we imposed a big quarantine against Good. Cuba, which exists up to today. Mm -hmm. You know, the Russians came in with about 4.4 to $5 billion a year to the, to the Cubans in, 